I'm Katie Partridge, a soprano with Luminous Voices, a professional chamber choir from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, conducted by our artistic director, Timothy Shantz. Our choir hasn't really been singing together normally since the Alberta government shut down singing activities and performance venues last March. Luckily, some of the restrictions were lifted at the end of the summer, and we were able to get together to sing in October under strict guidelines from Alberta Health Services. Eight singers, plus our conductor, were allowed to sing at a church. We were standing more than six feet apart, and we could only sing for one hour, following which we had to leave the church so that they could filter the air. We had to have a temperature check each time we re-entered the church, and we had to fill in and sign a COVID checklist every day. The hardest part for me is we had to wear masks when we were singing. I had to find a different way to inhale and exhale, and I had to get used to this foreign object in my face that moved up and down each time I approached a high note. <laughs> this was a whole new level of professional choral singing. One of the pieces we recorded was Sven David Sandstrom's To See the World in a Grain of Sand. I think this may have been programmed because many of us had been exploring nature and discovering how any one thing can reveal the riches of the universe. I mean, what else are we going to do during a lockdown? In his book, Indian Horse, Richard Wagamese wrote, We need mystery. Creator in her wisdom knew this. Mystery fills us with awe and wonder. Sandstrom, to me, reflects this awe and wonder, not only through the text that he chose, but also through his rich harmonic and chromatic language, and also his technique of layering text on top of text and voices on top of voices. <laughs> 